It's time for tea, and this is Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we spill and sip tea while analyzing the biggest entertainment stories. I am Ifeo Luo Oshike, and I'm here with the gorgeous Ewa Ritu and the outspoken Benny Ak. Who's good, guys? Gorgeous is the I'm word. I'm great. I like that outspoken. I'm pretty much outspoken. Oh, man. OK. Finally, finally, yeah. we found something, <laughs> something so we'll that suits him perfectly. We'll just keep using that. <laughs> no, outspoken, no, no, right. outspoken. Controversial is good. Outspoken is good. Outspoken is good. Yeah, controversial yeah, yeah. is outspoken, good. Controversial but super is intelligent, good. no. I am intelligent. But not super intelligent. My kids are super intelligent. Seriously. <laughs> We're not talking about show. your kids. <laughs> <laughs> because I tell them you're super intelligent. So oh, I'm, you I tell them. Intelligent. Okay. No. All right, that's that's the way to go. You need to teach the they ways. They are super in the, intelligent. In the mm -hmm. way so that when they grow, they won't depart from it. They'll remain mm -hmm. super intelligent. Is that like some scriptural verse? In yeah, the Bible? but I made it um, circular. So. Like remix. It, oh, it's wow. a remix. <laughs> so this is yeah. like <laughs> share yes. A edited version or revised edition. We share. Uh, oh, it's your name. Oshunke. Oshunke. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> I was wondering. Or, or what's that Babushka surname? Or Dunke or whatever it is. Are you, <laughs> are you two from the same zone? Like, well, yeah, well, they're well, kind of well, related. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's so good. <laughs> Today's lineup: Takashi Six Nine's real name Daniel Hernandez was sentenced to 24 months in prison, 13 of which were deemed already served in jail. He also faces five years of supervised release, 300 hours of community service, and a $35,000 fine. His estranged dad was also present in court and promised to set his son straight. But when he said he was going to set his son straight, I figured it was kind of about the money. He said he got money, so I'm going to set him straight so apparently it has to be nothing for, but for money and clout yeah because, because you've been absent from this boy's life since, since like was six nine years. Or, was it nine yeah, or six it was nine years nine old, and so. then you're just coming now does he think this is like some um good news that he should be you know excited about i don't know why he was even there in the first place should trade places the father should go to go to jail. Yeah. <laughs> right. Because maybe he was mm. around. Because I'm sorry, it's his failure as a father, all right, mm -hmm. that put Takashi in the position he is right. right now. And there's so many absent fathers, you yeah. know, fathers who are not present in life with mm -hmm. their kids. And I wonder why that is. It's it, it's prevalent in the black community, mm. you know. And I begin to feel like there's a systematic orchestration to totally sideline the role of fathers yeah. in their kids' life. Even in Nigeria, that is beginning to happen. You sure, know, where sure. mothers are telling you they are kings, mm. you know, because they're raising up their children, you know what I mean? I don't need a father, I don't need a man that can raise a child over myself. The role of the father is systematically being blotted out, obliterated mm. In, mm. in the grand scheme of, of the family. You know, so Tekashi's father should be ashamed of himself, I'm going to say that. And not he even show up in court. But I, 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 I don't even, failed, in his failed, case, I don't think. He failed in his duties, and that's why Tekashi is in a big mess he is right now. But you, can, you yeah. can't say that, um, you can't generalize that. No, no, bro, yeah, that's bro, what I'm saying. No, and that it's not generalization. This is it. This in their, this is it. Um, it's not generalization. And they still turned out bad. No, no, so. not, 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 it's not generalization. It's, it's a problem fact that the absence of a father in the home has detrimental effect to any child. We can't even downplay it. Yes, no, as a mother, you can do a good job yeah. in raising up your kids. Are there mothers who have raised up their kids? Well, yes. But I'm sorry, she can't be the father. It's not possible. Of course, she can't now, be the I mean, father. I but what if she's trying to say? Sorry, sweetheart. I say this to say, right, the things my little boy, so I'm bringing my boy, the thing that my little boy does with the mom and gets away with it, it when I show easy. up, he sits up. It's just, it's just something about fatherhood. You can't take it away. So Takashi's father failed in that regard. Mm. We can't even take that away. He did. But I mean, in his own case, nobody took his duty off him. He just left his own responsibility. So this is not about somebody trying to no, say... No, actually, the reason, reason the reason he left... Say, no, the, reason, the reason the father no, even no, left no. in the first place was because um, Takashi's mom kicked him out when she realized he was using heroin in front of the kids or around the kids. Mm. You understand? So he was kicked out of the house. So, so he wasn't he, even a good father. Yeah, he wasn't a go. good father. So right now, it was like he got money, he got me. So I'm going to set him straight. I'm going to be there. And I'm like, okay, what happened to all these years when this, guy set needed, straight, man. when this guy needed you? So Money it's, magnifies. It's just sad. But I, I think I take back my words. Because uh, yesterday I was saying I don't think Tekashi would get less than yeah, 30 I, I, years. Right? Yeah, I, yeah, I knew and, uh, that. I wonder what Charlemagne is going to do get. now. 24 months, isn't it? And they did 11 part months, of it. Because you already outside, spent 13 months. So he's probably going to be there for like a week. No, 11 months. 
He has 11 months left to spend. Now, let's say this to cheat the God. Cheat the God, you better make your words come true. Yeah, so mm. we're waiting for you, bro. <laughs> no, but, but it's still not a sentencing, though. Yeah. What Charlemagne said, there's no way that he was not gonna get up. He was gonna get up this case without being sentenced. So oh, he's still gonna sentence him. Everyone knew that now. Everybody so knew it was. Everyone, Charlemagne is so the yeah. he's up everyone the knew that. Uh, okay, even know. if it's a community set, yeah. but Charlemagne made it look like, look, this guy has to spend the, the forty-seven of, years. Right. He never said so. <laughs> no, I'm saying, but that was what, how it that sounded. Was, that yeah, was right. how it sounded. You understand? So Charlemagne. You I mean, I don't know if I'm so excited for him, but yeah, I'm happy for him because if the judge feels that. Is a change person. Mm. Anybody can change, and if this is what the judge thinks is change right. Person, I'm not pretty sure about that. I don't think Let him get changed. back into the community. Yes. Mm. Yeah, but till the then, you just have to believe that he's. Changed. And then he's not safe at the same time. I'm worried about his safety. That's the most. Um, that's the thing I'm worried the most about mm. because the safety is not guaranteed anymore. You snitched on a lot of people. A lot of people are behind bars. A lot of people are spending more time and than that's you a good are thing. behind bars. Well, that's a good no, thing. No, it's a good thing, mm. but come on. We call those people gangsters. We call them thugs. Mm. We call them murderers. We call them people that are involved in different crimes. What is the guarantee that they will not go after Tekashi? Of course. There's, I'm sure there's a price on his head already. Now that they know he's coming price out so soon, I'm sure there's a price. Price on his head already, but I made this decision. You know, he knows that. I'm sure. Because he's, he's probably going to leave. Yeah, it's, it's fully aware that if he I comes mean, out, somebody wants to get him down. So the end he's of the ready. Show, I have a public service announcement to make. So let's go on with the show. I just have a public service announcement I need to make. Okay, we're looking forward to that public it's a, it's a <laughs> declaration. <laughs> and um, <laughs> on that note, it's time for a break. But when we return, we still have more stories to discuss. Stay with us on Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. <laughs> Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child. I see them every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like Ali Alibaba? Alibaba. Oh, <laughs> Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to die, everybody feeling all right. Still buy. Sometimes I look myself minimal eye. You. Mm. Apala music is for mature-minded people. That got DM sometimes from Malawi. Like, what? Sleeping early. Sleeping early. Welcome back to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, and then we're moving on to the next story. David O was seen in a video that has now gone viral, endorsing a show by Koza Church while having a conversation with a little girl. He has faced backlash from the said video, but the singer has reacted, saying, I'm writing to quickly disclaim viral videos going around of me advertising for Koza events. I have nothing or whatsoever to do with the church. The fact I did a quick video for a kid introduced as a fan just for a personal use and it was chopped up and used for such an advert extremely disappoints me. It is fraudulent and extremely disrespectful. I have never and definitely not associated with Koza Church and I've reached out to those responsible for this madness immediately. I will most certainly be proceeding further if you do not retract that video. A word is enough. You said it all. Well said. said. Mm -hmm. well well said. said. There's really nothing to burn on this story. I mean, it's mm -hmm. just ridiculous how far the length people will go just to make some things appear real that are not yeah. real. Mm. You know, and I, I can understand why he's reacting this way. There's a whole lot of stake for him if mm -hmm. it ends up being true. Because a lot of know, his fans will probably decamp if once it, they find out. Um, the, the young girl's uh, mother already put out a statement yeah. also saying that it was an innocent video that mm -hmm. he just, okay, as friends, just do it for the daughter and just enjoy. Not necessarily for but the But that church. thing looked scripted, if you ask me, though. What looks it scripted? looked the video. Did you watch the viral video? Yeah, I did. You know, like, is it so bad right now? You need Davido to endorse you to say you're credible as a child. And he said Davido, Davido. You know, said David Doe, is that, is that David Doe is my friend, and he said he puts God much, first. David Doe, my friend. Is, like, is that how much you're clamoring for validation? Um, to be honest, then, when I saw the video, so that was really when I when I saw the video, and I'm wondering. <sighs> Davido advert church. Well, I'm like, well, is it that bad? and you, you also know? said Davido will be present at the event, so 
Yeah, he, Biodo, I don't know if you saw Biodo's post. And no. They did a full advert, like it was looking really good. I mean, good. yeah, you know, and they, they paid blogs time. to post they to paid, repost the video. They paid the graphics designer. That's an desperation. Put, I mean, yeah. what, what are you trying to, to what prove? What are you trying to prove? What that point uh, David Doe will be at our Koza concert, so I'm not a rapist after all. So I mean, <laughs> who is David Doe to say you're not a rapist so or exactly. not? Why would I believe David it? David Doe's validation yeah. to clear you of all the allegations? Okay. That's they need David's nice. validation to play a pastor, a man uh, of God. That's, that's ridiculous. Very though. ridiculous. <laughs> and then I'm wondering what a David Doe, because he said David Doe was going to be there. Was David Doe going to be there as a, um, a part of the congregation? Risky, or was he going to be? Risky, risky. Well, the man is risky. It's a, it's a in church. now. Like, <laughs> yeah. Go trauma my, it's going to do trauma my love and there and fire mm -hmm. and fall. <laughs> you <sure>. know. <laughs> and, uh, uh, Anima shall. Yeah, uh, that's, that's some that, spiritual that's, that's a spiritual <laughs> one. You probably go there to do. my mind. Lo ah, it's man, just like, ridiculous. come on. Like, Everything I really don't understand what these pastors up. are trying to do. Especially, I once said that I went to a church and um, the moment any celebrity walks in, they give them special recognition. Ladies and gentlemen, Solid Star just walked in. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we have Fireboy in the building. I'm not sorry, any name I call right now is not the name, they're not mm. the names they called, but um, let me just put that out there before they come from. Oh, Fireboy just came out. Oh, Olami, they just walked in. Ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together for David Doe. And I'm wondering, like, what am I doing here? I didn't even wait to the end of the service, and I left. Most That's good churches for you. Are, Do you understand? Most churches are entertainment centers these days. Like, you're going for a live concert at a hotel, you know, with fireworks <laughs> and fire lightings on stage. You begin to wonder, listen, this, this is like a concert I attend in a hotel. And they give you a reason that you know what is the 21st century, so to catch them, you mm. got to give them the baits that will attract them. It's just a whole lot of bullocks. No, for me, I don't see anything wrong in making and um, preaching the gospel or praising God more beautiful than it used to be. Mm. Of course, you don't expect us to praise him the way he used we, to uh, be then. I mean, it's okay to be. How did he used to be then, though? <laughs> no, I mean, before, there were no, um, all those instruments were not there. All those things that they use now were not so there. I'm, so a graduate, I'm a graduate of business administration. Do you mm -hmm. understand? modernized, commercialized marketing, and mm -hmm. that that's the tool most of the churches are using today. It's all commercial, it's all commercials, it's all and for me, I, I, mm -hmm. I don't think anything is and I'm, wrong. I'm as beginning long to as think the church is now a business, not no, a place of worship anymore. Sense. Not for all of them. Sense. Not for all of them. Yeah, there's ones. still a few good ones, but definitely. But to be honest, like the I one see I nothing wrong currently. in making your church beautiful or putting all the lights and But don't make it all about that. But I also have a problem with, uh, okay, in as much as we want to say, okay, David Doe is a circular artist, but it is the presence of the Lord and I think everyone is welcome so if uh, David was going to be there as long as it's not the problem I have is when you have a celebrity in your midst and then you're bringing that person on stage to come and say a few words to the people. If you're what, saying what somebody is going to be an, at an event that means the person is going to be there for something significant. Yeah. Well, but I don't know if you guys saw what happened last week about a lady that came out and said um, they were stopped by the church security and they were kicked out for the way they were dressed. Mm. And I was wondering, like, is the church not in the heart and not in the outlook? Can we move and, on? And, and, and I mean, apart from that, people are supposed to go to No, no, just say, just say. Can we move on? I'll carry it in the news. That's my cousin. That's your cousin. That's my cousin. Before we move on, I mean, I want to just put it out there that people are supposed to go to church to get saved. So even if you see somebody dressing in a to the church. Let them in. Let them first. in. And then whatever you want After to do, the preach, service, you could say, talk oh, to them can, we, can we have a chat with you? Know. you can then. Hallelujah. And the church ends right here. <laughs> <laughs> but um, at the end of the day, Oh, Pastor, no, 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 I just wanted to have a quick word with Pastor Biodo Fatsoyimbo. You don't need validation for you to be cleared of all your allegations. So, no David O is needed, all right? So, let's move on to the next story. Al Kelly pleads not guilty bribing to get enough, pleads not guilty bribing to get in a fake Aliyah ID. Even though Al Kelly's ex store manager, Dimitri Smith, has publicly backed the police officer's claim that his old boss had the ID made for his future bride which was used to obtain their marriage license under false pretenses. But um, he was in, on a video call in court yesterday because he wasn't there physically, and he pleaded not guilty to the charges of bribing. You know, um, nothing feel, so exciting about this news. What were you expecting? You know, feel, yeah, of course. Feel, of course, it will plead I not guilty. I feel pity for Kelly right now. Because we I all can do. only imagine 
I don't. The whole, the whole psychological, emotional drop, uh, trauma is going. But that's right if now. he is not guilty. <laughs> but this is then they should go ahead. They should, they should prove him guilty already. Don't you get they it? They don't have enough evidence. They don't have enough evidence. They don't have Thank you. They don't have enough evidence because the evidence has got to be sufficient. Mm -hmm. So the reason why this case is still lingering because the evidence is another are thing not you need to remember is that this you know, these cases are really the expensive. Evidence. This trial, yeah. are expensive. Yeah. this investigation, you know, you know are why expensive. You, you will not win in a rape case. Why? Because you don't have sufficient that's evidence. It. Yes, but that is and, not. And that is why the Bosola, the Bosola, know, that's why the Bosola case just got kicked out. Right? But that's not you know fair. Like, At the end of the day, it's still not fair. If Arkel is not going to, if truly is in, um, is guilty, and then because there's no sufficient evidence, no, but what if truly freely. is innocent? Why we, why we so bent on him being guilty? No, no. Let me explain no. what I feel because I think on some cases they have enough evidence to try yeah. or to charge Arkel or on sentence him. Ground, but on some other grounds they don't. But it's, you know what? They can't be doing, okay, this one, you're guilty, go. Mm. This one, you're not guilty, yeah. stay. On you understand? Counts. So they need to make sure on that all this counts. is all finalized before they sentence him. Because this, we're just looking at it, but these trials are pretty expensive. Yeah, they the are. cost of investigation and all of that, it's so much. So you can't expect them to be doing um, an halfway cross kind of thing. It has to be all the way. You understand? So that's mm. the way I see it. So it's not about R. Kelly not, it's not about them not having enough evidence. I just think they want to gather all the evidences mm. that of all the charges against no, R. Kelly still, that's, before. That's the, they still boil down to the same thing. They don't have sufficient evidence yet to totally nail On it. some cases, some because cases. truth is, um, R. Kelly can't beat this case. Let's put it, it that way. Yeah, he can. With, with, with everything that's happened, yeah. and yes. with the media publicity, mm -hmm. of course, he's a dead man already. Mm. <laughs> the Do way you, you say that, he's a whole, dead man. The whole wide world, I mean, when I say he's a dead man, I don't mean that literally. No, the whole I know, wide I know. world came out with a theme, Surviving R. Kelly. Mm -hmm. Are you kidding me? Almost all, almost all the women in America jumped on that, mm. Surviving R. Kelly. R. Mm. Kelly became a theme, you know, you need to survive. Mm. I mean, so already the, the, cake, the case has been prejudged mm. by the media. He's guilty, uh -huh. and it's gonna be hard for him to get off this case the way it is. Even OJ's lawyer cannot help him out at this point in time. That's uh -huh. why we all know OJ did it. Okay. Oh. I okay. Now you that. think OJ did it, but you don't think Naira uh, R. Kelly did Naira it. Mali. <laughs> Sorry. Speaking of Naira Mali, I thought you had a oh yeah, you had a confession. Oh, oh, no, 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 but she just called just his name instead okay. of R. Kelly. Um, it's a public service announcement. I just want to declare mm -hmm. that I'm now a Malian. But hold up, there's a clause to that. I'm a Malian, but I'm an, you know, they're all millennials. Mm -hmm. I'm an older millennial Malian. So I subscribe okay, so to his why? philosophies. Exactly. I subscribe to his thoughts, school of thought. You won't find me sagging my jeans, trousers, bedless. I'm too old for that. And so you won't catch me, I mean, smoking <laughs> ash on the street. But to his thoughts, get on Naramali's Twitter and see most of the things he talks about. I subscribe to his thoughts, his school of thought, his philosophies, and he has values. Mm. So, I mean, so yes, yeah, so I declare myself today publicly as an older millennial Malian. I think this is the part where we go <laughs> Malian, 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 but I'm, lo I'm loving that dude now every day. I don't know why, but I'm just loving him every day. Morning, we're lighter. Eh? Lighter or YBN. Hey. And we move on. It's time for a break <laughs> and stay with us on Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. Don't go nowhere. Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child. I just see them every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like an Alibaba? Alibaba. <laughs> <laughs> Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to do it. Everybody feeling all right. Still buy. Sometimes I look myself, minimal are you? Mm. Akpala music is for mature minded people. I got DM sometimes from Malawi, like, woo! Sleeping early, sleeping early.
Welcome back, and you still locked to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. So, media consultant Abi Oyebade is wondering why only the ladies in Nollywood industry are the ones buying cribs and cars. And when I say cribs, I mean houses and cars. And she questioned if the men aren't working hard enough, or is, or if there is some sort of gender pay gap. Mm. I'm tired. Payback. I'm, I'm, Payback. Pay I'm gap. tired. Pay gap. Because Everybody keeps asking this question. At this point, I think, I'm sorry, but if it was the men, yeah, that were buying the cars and the crib, would the word question what is going on in the industry first? And second, I think the men are doing fine. Mm. The men are buying I, houses. I was just say that. Yeah, the <laughs> men are doing fine. They're buying houses, they're buying cars, they're doing all. It's just that it's not getting to the news because they are men. Mm -hmm. I mean, exactly. it's, 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 no, it's no news. It's no news that yeah. a man is buying a house, well, a man is buying a Do you know I have a problem with that when we say it's no news when a man. But then why is it news when a woman that's the is problem. buying? No, that's the it's problem. no news either. That's like I've problem. seen very successful women. I've been around very successful if women. Exactly, I've been around women that work hard for a living. I can't, you remember the day we were coming to the office together and then we saw a girl in the G wagon and we're like, um, oh, damn, she must have been with her. She must have a very rich husband. Mm. Then I took back my words. I was like, come on, this girl might no, just no, be see, working hold on, Ife, that's the and problem, she got exactly. We cannot hide. So it's no news for a woman. Ife, I get what you're saying. It's, that's, what, what, that's exactly where I'm going now. It's not supposed to be news. That's why I'm tired of these people asking questions what people are doing or what the woman is doing to buy house. I think she's just trying to shake a why table. Are you, I'm tired, of that, or I'm tired of anybody shaking that table. At this point, I think you need to mind your business and stop, stop focusing on and people that your own obviously and have a cars job. And stop they have a job, people. they're actress, they have other businesses. I mean, almost all of them come out all the time and say they have side also. And it's there. They have business right. that they advertise. I'm, I'm going to tell you why it's news when a woman does something okay. this was significant a phenomenon because we live in a social, cultural, traditional society where mm. the woman is supposed not to be able to do those things because it's a man's world. Mm. So the woman, it's a woman's the woman world, is seen, actually. The woman is seen inferior to the man. The woman is not meant to have a voice. She's not meant to aspire to be great. She's not meant to be ambitious. She's mm. not meant to acquire property. She is the man's property. That is what patriarchy has reduced yeah, right. women Mention. to. And so when a woman who now rises and you know not just not just buy buys the entire buys the entire not just the bacon but brings the entire pig to the table, th there's a suspicion that okay People start question. who is mm. behind sponsoring her. this. You mm. know, so our society has reduced women who are successful, there's got to be some man behind her. There's right. got to be some man she's servicing. What happened to the same, care. behind every this great it. man, there's a, um, so, how do they say uh, it? Behind every successful lot. man, there's a it great woman. Called, yeah, that's, that's what he's trying to yeah. explain. That's how the society yeah. is being built. Called, the man has to be called, the successful yeah, one. It is called social conditioning and collective socialization. So mm. because we've so much thought about women this way, so if woman decides to go this way, uh, it, can't, it can't be mm. by But I think the, the people that still you know. think that way are still way, way behind because a lot of us have moved on now, from that. Now, I want to ask you question. Let me ask you a question. I was having a conversation true. with a friend of mine No, it's true. Me ask you. I a a lot of, that's you, but I'm saying a lot of people now yeah. still think that way. They're trying to form all I think yeah. it's 50-50 now. You can can't say majority of the people. I was having a conversation, a chat with a female friend of mine last night. Why are you a man? What makes you a man? What makes me a man? Yeah, have you ever thought about it? What makes you a man? I think the ability in, to take responsibilities. The ability to take responsibility. What, what sort of responsibility? There are traditional roles that have been given to men in the society mm. we live in that a man is supposed to provide mm. shelter, food, mm. clothes for his family. Mm. Now, let me ask you this. In the 21st century, there are a lot of women who can do all of that. Right. A lot of women that do all of that. Of, Even in Ghana, so most of the women are the ones. If those, things, if those things, if those roles, those traditional roles, is what makes you and defines you as a man, mm. then what happens when you meet a woman who doesn't need any of those things? Mm. Are you still a man? Then the question is really, who is a man? Assize those roles. If, uh, if uh, answer the question, <laughs> yes, you're still a man because at the end of the day, it still does not take away the fact that you can do what you want to do and does not stop the woman from doing what she wants to do. Thank you very much. It's understanding our individual roles. Yeah. Roles, <laughs> how we can complement each other. So, okay. when I'm able to do those things or not, does I didn't it answer the less? question yeah, because right. I was going to leave that question <laughs> to the viewers, um, especially the men out there. What makes you a man and the women? What makes you a woman? Think about it and you can tweet at us on Plus TV Africa. But it's time for us to go on to the 
today's episode oh. of Tea Time. But remember, you can catch up on this episode and all our exclusive contents by subscribing to our YouTube channel at Plus TV Africa. You can also watch Tea Time on Auto TV and in London on Ben Television. My thank you, as always, goes to my co-anchors, Ewa and Benny, the oh, Malians, yeah. and your, for their contributions, <laughs> and the entire production team. I am a fellow Oshikaya Saint. Thank you for watching, and stay blessed.